It is off to trial for Detroit mother Latoya Powell's a grieving mother and defendant. Yeah, that was the result of a pretty unusual pre-trial hearing where an accident victim faces charges of her own in the death of her six-month-old child. Local for Rod Maloney, live downtown with more on this story. Rod? Yeah, Steve, tragedy doesn't begin to cover this story. And as a matter of fact, it's, it's one of those things that didn't have to happen at all. It was a hit and run accident. But by the time they were done, both drivers ended up being charged. An older model minivan driving along Puritan and Archdale gets T-boned by a car on May 18th. Four children go flying out of the van. Inside was the mom and the grandmother, Kay Powell. Some man in another car came up and hit us. And um, what happened during the crash, if you remember? Uh, we flipped over three times. I hit my head. All I know, uh, when I uh, got out, I passed out. I don't remember. Okay. I hit my head. Six-month-old Demetrius Brown Jr. ended up killed. The grieving okay. mother behind the wheel, Latoya okay. Powells, she ended up charged in voluntary manslaughter, second-degree child abuse, operating with a high blood alcohol level, driving drunk with occupants under the age of 16, and operating on a suspended license. Her mother says she remembers nothing about the accident and even less about her daughter's condition. Did you witness her drinking the alcohol? No. On that day and at that time prior to getting in the vehicle, what, had she been drinking any, any alcohol? No. The first officer on the scene, Melissa Adams, testified she remembers something very distinctive about this tragic scene. There was glass everywhere. Um, there was a small puddle of blood on the street. Um, there was a small, uh, excuse me, a strong smell of alcohol. Now, the judge decided to send both of these cases off for trial or the possibility of a trial, depending on whether a plea bargain might be in order here. In the meantime, DeAndre Cooty is the one charged with driving the car that hit the minivan. And again, he is going off to trial as well. He had waived his preliminary hearing today. Reporting live downtown, Rod Maloney, Local 4.